Welcome to the Humanitarian Support Unit here in Kathmandu, Nepal. What we wish to show you today is an innovative product that we've developed here in Kathmandu in support of the Ministry of Home Affairs efforts to enhance their disaster preparedness and response capacity. And here it is. And it's called a guidance note on disaster preparedness and response planning for 2011. And this has been uh, published in English but also published in Nepali for the benefit of our uh, national colleagues. This has been endorsed and disseminated by the Ministry of Home Affairs. While preparing this document, we consulted all the humanitarian agencies, government, Red Cross. There is a template developed what should be in the uh, disaster preparedness plan. So the content of these uh, guidelines is mainly how to organize the workshops, how to organize the meetings, what are the agendas, and how to uh, do all the hazard mappings in the districts, and the, this all the processes adopted by the uh, government authorities. We have got one page timeline document. I hope you have got the copy of this in front of you. In this document, what we would like to show how OHSU in Nepal supported the government um, of Nepal to do the disaster preparedness planning workshop across the country. This year in 2011, following the preparation of this guidance note that, uh, that has been just pro uh, shown to you, we have been able to support the whole 75 districts to, pre to prepare the uh, disaster preparedness and response plan in Nepal. The government has taken initiatives in the recent years to develop response plan at local level as well. To continue this efforts, we are organizing this important workshop today and expect valuable feedback and comments from you all. The Jilako, the disaster preparedness initiative, co currently, the coordinated effort, co currently, the Lakli, Tome, you got to be the person who to Lama, Ramros, and manage the answer. This is a language plan. We believe this is a sustainable product and in 2012 we expect that many districts will take it upon themselves to organise the planning process and contribute funds to the workshops. This is a small but significant step as disaster preparedness gradually becomes institutionalised in Nepal which is undoubtedly welcome for those Nepalis afflicted by recurrent natural disasters every year. Uh, we very much uh, hope you've enjoyed this brief introduction to the guidance package and we hope it may be of some use to our colleagues in the field and elsewhere. If you wish to look at the document or uh, download a copy, it's available at www.un.org.np slash disaster preparedness. So for now, thank you very much and it's bye-bye and namaste, namaste. from Kathmandu.